Hi, I'm Donna Wolf from Nastasia.com. Today's video is from my Stitch-O-Rama by Nastasia collection. This is a fun post stitch, but it's a little difficult, so please be sure to download the written pattern on Nastasia.com. To begin, chain 33 or any multiple of 6 plus 3. Single crochet in the second chain from the hook and single crochet in each chain across. We need to mark stitch number two and every sixth stitch from there. So be sure to mark stitch number eight and stitch number 14. Keep going until the last chain. By the way, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notified of new videos from me each week. Here's what your chain looks like now. Chain three and turn your work. That chain three counts as your first double crochet. Make one double crochet across the entire row. At the end, make your last double crochet and then switch to a second yarn color. Chain one and turn your work. The first three stitches are single crochet stitches. Remove the stitch marker. We're going to make a treble crochet front post stitch around the stitch we previously marked. And Make another treble crochet front post stitch around the stitch right before the other marker. Skip the two stitches and then make a single crochet in the next stitch and in the next three stitches for a total of four single crochet stitches. Make another treble crochet front post stitch in the marked stitch. and another treble crochet front post stitch in the stitch right before the next marked stitch. Skip the two on top and single crochet in the next four stitches. Make another treble crochet front post stitch in the marked stitch. And another one in the stitch before the next stitch marker. Skip the two on top and make one single crochet in the next four stitches. And we'll repeat this process again. At the end, 
you will only put one single crochet in the last three stitches. And here's what it looks like. Also, if you're on social media, you can also find me on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and Twitter. Next row, chain three and turn your work. Make one double crochet in each stitch across. As before, at the end, we're going to switch back to the green color like this. Chain one and turn your work. Single crochet in the first stitch. Treble crochet front post stitch. Skip one and single crochet in the next four stitches. Treble crochet front post stitch like this. Take note of exactly where I am placing my hook. This will help make the X's and diamonds appear nicely. After the four single crochet stitches, do another treble crochet front post stitch. Continue with this pattern across the row. At the very end, you will make just one single crochet in the last stitch. Chain three and turn your work. That counts as the first double crochet. Make one double crochet in each stitch across. And as before, switch over on your last double crochet to the pink color. Chain one and turn your work. This row will just repeat the previous pink row. Three single crochet stitches. followed by the treble crochet front post stitch. Another treble crochet front post stitch. You can see the direction matches here. Four single crochet stitches next. Another treble crochet front post stitch here. And another one here. Continue this across the row. At the end, you will put one single crochet in the next three stitches. Chain three and turn your work. This row repeats the double crochet stitches across. Connect your green again and do the same as the previous green row. One single crochet, followed by a treble crochet front post stitch, followed by four single crochet stitches. And another treble crochet front post stitch. Make sure all of your green post stitches match the previous green rows post stitches. Continue in this manner until you are happy with the height of your sample. I hope this video has helped you. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and like and comment on this video. Check out the video's description and the info button. 
Also, this video has both closed captions and auto-translated subtitles. And please visit Nastasia.com for more tips and tricks on creative, self-sufficient living.